Okay, October the 10th, 2016. Uh, before we do anything else, I want these guys to, to uh, stir them up. up a little bit, but that's not really what I was wanting. What I really want you to do is I want you to see how few names are in this tumbler. And uh, your name needs to be in there. Now, we're giving away a Himalayan Ibex today, which is a fantastic hunt in Pakistan with Cabernet Safaris. And uh, I actually have hunted with Cabernet Safaris in Pakistan before, and these folks really know Pakistan. And uh, Riza and Maymet uh, of Cabernet Safaris will do a wonderful job for you, and uh, they will take care of all the details and even have one of their people there, if it's not Riza or Maymet themselves, one of their uh, highly qualified people there with you. So this is a uh, first class hunt, as are all of the Ovis Capper hunts for the year. We'll be continuing on into next year as well. Now, the reason that I wanted you to see how few are in there is to let you know that the next drawing, uh, which will be the second Monday of uh, November, we'll be giving away a Marco Polo hunt in Tajikistan. And that'll be with the hunting consortium, uh, Bob Kern. And uh, so you need to get signed up for the Ovis Capra. And I wanted to try to remind you of that today. Uh, we've got uh, not all of our crew today, but we've got a lot of the crew. We've got Chris Naylor, Paul Watkins, John Campbell, Cameron Mitchell, and Dennis Campbell. And I'm Dennis Campbell. And behind the camera, of course, as always, is David Pridemore. So without further ado, we'll, we'll let young 20-year-old uh, John Campbell draw the winning ticket. He's going to make somebody happy. Got his back turned, nothing in his hand. He's going to reach in and uh, stir it around really good. He's stirring him up, and he's stirring him up, and he's going to find one, and he's not even going to look at it. And he's going to hand it to me. And I cannot believe this. There you go. A well known person around the office here. Oh. This is young Mackenzie Sims. <laughs> How old is Mackenzie? Yeah, young man. Uh, Mackenzie started young and he's had terrific success uh, as a young hunter. And uh, Mackenzie, I uh, can't remember right now if you've been on international hunts or not. Oh, yes, he has. Cameron told me. So uh, I was corrected. Uh, Mackenzie lives in uh, Wyoming. We're gonna try. See if we can make him really happy. Put it on speaker. Uh oh. Mackenzie, you gotta set up your voicemail box if you want us to, to leave you a message. Uh, just kidding around, of course. We'll send uh, we'll send Mackenzie a uh, an email. Uh, when we get uh, finished here, uh, congratulations to you, Mackenzie, uh, and uh, thank you for being uh, a great supportive member of GSCO and for sending in those hunt reports. Man, Mackenzie, he's, again, he's had some uh, terrific success. Was it Mackenzie that killed that great big elk recently? Yeah. yeah. Uh, great big one. Uh, anyway, uh, again, congratulations, Mackenzie, and to all of you. Again, notice that there's not many names in there, and uh, uh, you could be in there. It's only $100 a month, and uh, you'd be able to win a fantastic hunt like this one and uh, the, the Marco Polo hunt we're about to give away next month. Uh, thanks again to all of you, and until next time.